Hello, this is Jerome Cerulea and today is Sunday in the Philippines and I'm going to share to you updates regarding to my garden or vertical garden here in the Philippines here in my apartment come let it close up and let's have fun so basically what you're looking right now is the wandering do that I'm planted and it grows bushy and I like the way that it's right now and hopefully those leaves going to turn to those uh, at the other side or at the other side of the fence so that it will become more like a plant curtain this one is a uh, patos that one is Pakepukol and this one really grew to cover approximately three layers of these trusses this is the Bayana and then this one is another side of Mayana at the other side of the fence basically those are off I'm not so sure if there are legal settlers, but hope not. That's the school of Santa Catalina. And then this is also a wandering view. view. This is the purple part. This is oregano. That is lemongrass. By the way, uh, that one is also a Mayana. I was being given by our neighbor. And this is the result of it. It really grew high and I really like it. Those are oregano purple hearts. I really like my vertical garden. This is, I took it from my ate, the spider plant. They are the new member of this family. And then I don't know what you call this plant, but I call it heart heart because the heart shaped leaf. I plant it together with a 10 o'clock plant. I am not sure if you call it 10 o'clock plant, but I call it 10 o'clock plant. Those are my cactus, cacti. These are photos. They are placed inside our bathroom, but I just put it here to have sunshine. A pathos, a leaf, I just planted it there. This one, I don't know what you call this plant. We have it from Quezon City Memorial Circle. A guardian of our plants. This is also a Mayana. It's also from our neighbor. There's a gnome. There's another gnome here. And there's two gnomes looking outside. There you go. There's a vase, and this ZZ plant used to be in this vase, not knowingly that their stem is being punctured by the stones. These stones. I just plant this ZZ plant here just this morning. Hopefully, that we're going to survive. Well, I just saved this from my ate. Hopefully, they're gonna survive too. This is a cactus or succulent. I hope they're gonna survive too. Hopefully. This one is getting sad. 
this one too. I don't know what's going on. This is the survivor. I bought this one in December and they're still alive. And they're growing cute. I really like that cotton part of this succulent. I'm just going to let it be that one and hopefully this one is gonna survive. I don't know what happened. But this one is survivor I think. But it looks sad. And this is the saddest. The purple heart. Purple heart. This is the fortune plant. This one is I don't know what it is, but the snake plant. This is Potos. For the longest time, I'm calling it Patos, mm. but knowingly it is Potos. Those are the corals. I get them from Balinao. This one, these two at front is I get it from the old rock. That one is in Patar. Likewise, that other one at the other side, and then of course the heart shape is also from Patar. The photos, Zizi plant, that is Santa Catalina. Okay, thank you for watching. Bye for now.